Hello, my lovely Capricorn. How are you, loves? I hope everybody's well. Capricorn, today we'll do a spread a reading for the singles for the month of March. As I've been promised to all of you, loves, we'll do a singles. And if you are not dealing with anybody and you are real single, this reading is for you, loves. Sun, Moon, Rising Signs, and Venus Signs, General Purposes. Also, whatever comes, regards your love, regards finances, school, whatever is out there. This I will speak about in this reading. So let's see here, loves, as we just got on the new moon, the energies are flowing better. We still in the retrograde till the March 10th but let's see here how the energy flows for you we'll do a oracle message for you and of course we have the Lenormand cards and our messages from the spirit guides and from the tarot let's see here loves what we got and whatever message comes take what is resonate because general reading might resonate might not Singles, Sun, Moon, Rising, Science, Soulmates, number 41, and underneath we have number 4, Higher Power. For some of you, you just need to trust your guidance, what comes towards you, because for those singles, I don't see you, Capricorns, for long time single because there is an energy here comes for you as a soulmate although you are around somebody as we speak right now or the energy you got or the vibes you get right now it's for somebody here to come in a short time let's see here number 41 what's the message here the soulmate, the essential meaning of this card is harmonious partnerships, love, friendship, companionship, a relationship force, tearing personal growth. Strategic alliances are most important right now as you begin to attract the perfect people to support your dreams. This is a journey you will share with others, mentors, business partners, helpers, employers, creative partners, friends and strangers. Open door for you and step through the potential to join you in a harmonious dance of collaboration, commitment and co-creation. This is what you've been waiting for. All right, loves. I definitely see here the universe is working to brings you, to bring you the one you asking for, and most likely brings to you a soulmate. Also, you might fall in love in a very short time. Let's see here. Eleven. Ping pong. You not really know here what to do, but definitely here you Capricorn. First thing first, you gotta set up your boundaries. Also, the next step is to not be just like maybe yes, maybe no. Be very clear what do you want to happen into your life. Also, cut ties with who you've been in and out or who is not at your purpose anymore. Because there is somebody here comes into your life. It could be through your friends, could be through your... Like the way you are saying here, for some of you, you are just like going just to a party or to a, you know, a charity energy here, I get. And I definitely see here it is coming towards you. But there is somebody who've been in and out of your life and you're still single just because somebody is blocking your happiness. And also you need to be very firm with that person. Because I do not see here a, a very good place for somebody in the past. So if you are single right now, it's because for some of you, you need to set up those clear intentions. Also, being crystal clear who you need to cut off 
because that relationship will not develop, will be just maybe yes, maybe no, always, and that will not bring you. Could be somebody who you've been coupled before and you still have that reminiscing energies, but it shows to me that that is a dead end for you, for you to bring that commitment and somebody to put a ring on your fingers, you need to leave something behind. To not be just in that energy, oh, maybe, maybe. You need to do that for yourself if you really want to go forward with your life. And, of course, to come somebody into your life. Deep, deep inside, Capricorn, you do know. You do know you need to do this. And, yes, as you always said, oh, every job is hard. So the relationship are two, or vice versa. A relationship, it's a hard job. Of course, everything needs to be offered effort. And also, in a relationship, the effort needs to be put from both sides, not just from one side. Also, you need to be very firm. It's like, I'll give you an example. You have a job, and you got to go every single morning to that job. You're not saying, maybe yes, maybe I'll go today, maybe tomorrow I will not. Because you'll be fired. That's how a relationship is. Either you are in, either you are out. In between, that is not making it. Is not going yet. And for many of you, you definitely need to end something from the past. Although I feel here that happened, that's why you are single. And you are asking to do a lot of healing. And to not ignore the healing if you really want to move forward. There is definitely a new beginning here for you. If you really want to do the work. Somebody here really needs to do the work. And it is coming. I don't feel you really are ready for it. Or you are fully knowing that this is coming. But it is coming. After a lot of things happen for you. Okay. Let's see here. It's like for something you kind of like, this is not for me, this will never happen, I don't believe that person will ever come to me or I will never have the love of what I want. It is coming. For some of you don't really trust the process of the universe. But the universe is stepping in and it's telling you, hey, you got a new beginning. Don't stay in that past energy because four of cups is past energy. If you've been in a third party or with somebody in an unrequired love, let it go because the universe is telling you there is time to let it go. There is time for you to move forward because you got a new offer. For some of you, there is a new offer and it is something you, my loves, manifested. That person is not joke who's coming towards you. I definitely see it. You might feel it's too small and you want something big. Spirit tells you when it is coming, be firm. Be firm like this King of Swords. I manifested this. I deserve this. I want this and nothing less. And if you really want this Ace of Pentacles and the person gives you an Ace of Cups, the next answer of yours got to be no thank you. I've been there. I had that. I don't need that. Be firm if you really want something here. Because I feel here is a Capricorn here had enough and now it's just like, whatever it is, no thank you. Be very firm. If you really want a commitment, be firm with what you allow into your life. King of Cups we have here. Two of Pentacles. Six of Wands. King of Pentacles. Knight of Wands. Seven of Cups, World, Two of Cups, and Eight of Pentacles. Somebody here 
been in an energy of in out for over two years okay even I do this spread for single loves I definitely see here there is an energy for you although for some of you are very confused because the relationship was in and out that's what I got the energy as upfront for you loves that needs to be done okay because the intimacy with that person was awesome but they they are it's like I don't know if my Capricorn is the one for me or I should go should I put into work or should I go the love is here is not only a sex based relationship because I see you Knight of Wands in and out as we have this Sagittarian energy for some of you Capricorns you deal with a Cancer Scorpio Pisces could be a fellow, fellow Earth could be a Leo or a Sag here okay for a very small majority of you it is an air sign but what I do see here if you keep your options open because you are very busy with your work or whatever you do for your job and you feel like the job is number one love for you you need to reconsider those things because this could be a very good situation for you this person is ready to move forward if you are not in that notion as we have you here flip the energy since is a general but I definitely see here you are still keeping some options open and this person is kind of I don't know where I'm standing with you and the same time with you so for some of you or maybe most of you loves gotta be a sit down and let's talk do we close the chapter or we are opening and we are loving each other and we can work on this commitment together because some of you you are in that notion like I'm not sure okay because there are two single people here and is a situation here going on for quite a while and some some of you might still like I'm not sure if I want to settle down or not although might be also distance between you two that why could not be settled down but I see here somebody needs to clear that confusion for some reason is a notion of uh, I'm not sure if you are the one for me but I do have feelings for you because you both have feelings for each other it's not just one but you are very very confused let's see some of you are very much like I got what I got and I will stick what I got who is saying that loves who is saying that because I feel here for some of you you got through a lot and you sticking up with your ground but this situation you are in that's not continuing here can't continue this way could be a possibility yes to be in a union absolutely although as we have here my lovely Capricorn soulmates as you always know that this two of cups is a soulmate energy you are soulmates and I don't feel here even you are single and you want to still free this person wants clarity or you want that clarity here for some of you one of you might have children from a previous relationship and for some of you that's why you reconsidering because you feel like you will not be the main thing for the person that's why is that thing here let's see here two of pentacles four of wands for some of you this person is clearly thinking to a union with you this person clearly wants you that's that's 
that's an energy like they are just like I don't know what to do else to show how much I want my Capricorn okay this person might have Leo in the chart or Sag in a chart could be vice versa let's see here what about you loves why this seven of cups in here nine of wands I have no idea if I should trust you I have no idea if you are for real or I should trust you but I would like to have something with you I would like to have that joy energy in my life I would like to be the one for you but I've been hurt before so I'm not sure if I should trust that's why here for some of you for those of you Capricorns who have children you don't want to hurt your little ones and you don't really know if this person is the one who you to trust or to be with or to commit with and how that could be but you know you do love this person and also you do enjoy intimacy with this person and you do know it's not only about sex or just a in and out you do know that is love in here okay you do know this person is fated for you as we have the will of fortune here you do know that this person is fated to you so Capricorn for those of you singles who stay right now like I still love my freedom I feel here there is within four weeks one two months the latest you need to make up your mind okay because I definitely see you single but I definitely see here a soulmate next to you and if you second guessing here you are loves here you are so my loves this what I got here and also this could be the one for you I don't know why the Capricorn is second guessing here but I definitely see here with the tower here is either you go ahead either you are blowing apart also for a Capricorn here who has the energy of I will get hurt is because it is family or childhood energy still sticking with you or it is a past person who you've been with it's coming back those memories and that's why you just like back off back off I'm not sure I don't want to get hurt but when you are around this person it's energy is like taka 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 the end the, the your heart is beating very fast and you don't really know it's like I don't want to get that find the balance put the boundaries but I definitely see this person is the one for you but there is a past situation who it's kind of killed your heart or killed your soul half of it was not very much balance that kind of been for you okay for some of you Capricorns definitely you've been through a very nasty divorce and you try to bring yourself back here but definitely I see you I want to be with this person I want to go ahead with this person But you are not sure because you don't want to hurt to be hurt again. So yes, loves, this is what I got for you singles. And again, I don't see you for too long single. For those of you who really needed to hear this message and feel it valuable, let me know down below in the comments. And I thank you each of you who are coming here, who join the channel and love the work I do. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time. Namaste.